Hi there After Effects folks, let's take a look at how to make a very simple animated clock which ticks away one second per second and every minute jumps around, there we go okay so here's my new composition, just got a background layer in there and into this I'm going to drop a bit of clip art and scale this down okay so and I can lock that as well so that and then I'm going to use the rounded rectangle tool to draw a shape layer okay and this will be the the minutes hand okay so do that. now I want this anchor point here to be just at the bottom of this so I'll use my pan behind tool there you go I'll just click there to get that now if I zoom up you can see that I want the anchor point to be just on the bottom edge here in the center so as I move it if I hold down command or control I can snap that right to that point okay so I've got that there and then what I can do is I can transform center in view all right and I've got that right in the center so I'll rename this minutes okay so that's going to be my minutes hand so I'll just zoom out okay I'll I can duplicate this command D and I'll just drop that to the bottom I'll call this hours okay so I'll just turn off my minutes for a second and on the contents here rectangle one rectangle path on the size I'll just make that a little a little smaller and again I'll just adjust my anchor point and center in view okay so I've got now hours and minutes I'll just duplicate the minutes command D for duplicate and I'll just again on the contents here on rectangle size I'm just gonna squash it a little okay so that's gonna be my my minutes okay so I'll rename that sorry not minutes seconds I should say seconds so I've got hours minutes and seconds so the seconds I'm going to hit R for rotation I'm going to put the expression in so I want it to go a 360 in a minute okay so every second it's going to move around here so 360 divided by 60 is 6 so on the rotation if I alt click on the stopwatch and type in time times and six every second it's going to go six degrees so it's going around like this okay but what I want it to do is just tick at one second and not move continuously so I'll just use an effect for that I'll go to my effects and presets I'm going to type posterize I'm going to posterize the time and set the frame rate to one just put one here so every second it's just going to jump okay so that's looking fine so I'm just going to hit R and copy expression only I'm going to put that on the minutes hit paste and just press EE to see the expression okay so I want this to be basically 1 60th slower so that every minute it jumps forward and so if I do divide by 60 at the end of this expression okay you can see this is going to move slowly and as it goes around it gets to a minute okay and then it's going to keep going until we get to two minutes okay and 
if I made this composition longer, that would just continue. So on the press E for uh, effects here, I'm going to put my posterize time on this one, set that to one, and then just type at the end of that, divide by 60, because you can use maths in the effects. And now when we get to a minute, it's just going to jump. There we go, just go to a minute, boom. And so both of these hands are going to rotate and they're just going to, each minute, it's the minute hand's going to jump, every second the second hand's going to jump, and you've got yourself a ticking clock. And for the hours, I simply use keyframes because I couldn't set the posterize time that low. But you just, you know, obviously, you only need a few keyframes for the hours and set the keyframes to toggle hold keyframes, and you can animate that in the normal way. But that is a very simple way to just get the hands and the minutes going on a clock. And thanks for watching.